Vancouver's restaurants have long drawn international praise, but it's the revamped food cart program that's earning some serious street cred. One of the UK's leading newspapers is lauding the city's street food finesse for its mastery in the art of fusion and emphasis on fresh local ingredients. Marissa Thomas hit the pavement with Canada's own top chef for a little taste test. Food carts in Vancouver range from wacky to wow, and recently the Guardian newspaper, the world's second most read English online daily, called Vancouver's street carts the bomb and a massive turn on. He came in with a, a, a he, he's a past chef, he's opened restaurants, he's been all over the world. I think he, I just came in with a show me attitude yeah. and we showed him. Paul Dunn was the man who guided the Guardian food writer around town. He was shocked. His comment was, why aren't I living here? He said, food like this, a city that's beautiful, why aren't I living here? We wanted to do our own taste test and enlisted the help of Canada's top chef, Ensemble Restaurant's Dale McKay. By the looks of it, it's two of my favorite things to eat ever, so uh -huh. and brisket. <laughs> Sounds good. First stop is Reup, one of Vancouver's best-known carts we'll located at the Art Gallery. Sandwiches cost between seven and nine dollars. I'm gonna have the pork. Oh, if she's Please. going pork, I'll go beef. Okay, right. one of each. No, so scale of one to ten, what would you say for that one? Um, out of all the barbecue I've had in my life? Yeah. Uh, seven. Seven, okay. Yeah, I think it's, uh, it's definitely punches some flavor, good barbecue sauce, the meat's tender, crunchy, nice coleslaw. So we're at Jaffa Dog and the Guardian called this ridiculously delicious fusion food. Have you eaten here? I have. I've had a couple okay. times and I, I think it's, you know, it's a great idea and it's obviously done very, very well. I'll have number six, please. I'm going to have number nine, please. Do we cheers them or what are we cheers. going to cheers? Cheers. <laughs> Scale of one to ten? For a hot dog? Yeah. Or a Japanese hot dog? <laughs> Japanese hot dog. Maybe a five. A five. But a hot dog, okay. I would say it's maybe a seven. So it doesn't quite live up to the hype? Maybe not this one. So what are your thoughts on grilled cheese sandwiches? I love grilled cheese. What do you think of the presentation? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. It's kind of fun. It looks like good caramelization, mm -hmm. nice sourdough bread, a little bit of ketchup. Ketchup. Tastes like childhood. Hmm? Like childhood. For a classic grilled cheese, I'll mm -hmm. give it an eight and a half. Oh, Soho Road. Yeah. Okay. Indian food. Do you yep. like Indian food? I do, I love it. Okay. I'm Maybe going it. for veg. I've no, had a lot I'm, of I'm going today. chicken for sure. Chicken and okay. veg. Yeah. How would you rate that? First of all, I'd say it's the tastiest thing we've had today. Mm -hmm. I'd give it at least um, eight or nine. Mm -hmm. Especially because it's not overly spicy. It's just got really good flavor. Fresh local wild, have you eaten here? I haven't, no. So this menu, I would say, is on the more expensive end of the food carts. Yeah, but they're obviously using local and more kind yeah. of higher end ingredients. High quality. Okay, what do you like about that? A fresh horseradish. The meat's got a really nice roasted flavor, mm -hmm. and the horseradish is delicious. Mm -hmm. For a hot, you know, a beef sandwich like this, I'll give it a nine. So a friend comes to town, and you can only visit one food cart. Of the ones that we visited, which one would it be? Mm, probably the tandoori. Tandoori. Yeah, I thought they had a really, really clean, nice flavor, fresh, fresh um, naan bread. This would probably be number two. The verdict Vancouver street food scene has come a long way from nuts and hot dogs. Even Canada's top chef is impressed. Mm. Rightfully so, in, in many cases there. Wayne Cox is here with uh, whether our producer was just in my ear saying, do yeah. they deliver? I don't know if they deliver all the way out to Burnaby. I don't think so. Things got wheels, maybe. Great idea. <laughs> yeah. yeah.